I do not encourage or condone the use of tobacco or cannabis products, and if you're under the age of 18, you can go ahead and get out of here right now. Alrighty, so today I'm going to be talking a little bit about something I don't think anybody's ever wondered or anything anybody's ever talked about, you know what I'm saying? The topic of today's video, the unknown topic that I don't think anybody's ever talked about ever or I really ever wondered, is whether cigarette coupons should be legal or not. This is a very interesting thing to me, especially since a lot of anti-smoking organizations are kind of pushing for cigarettes to become a thing of the past, and yet there's still coupons for them. In fact, a lot of coupons. I cannot count the number of packs I've gotten, which are 50 cents to a dollar off kind of thing, and those coupons are just so, so, so cool to me, you know what I'm saying? And I, I love them kind of thing. Getting a dollar off a pack of cigarettes is absolutely, absolutely great. But today, as I said, I'm going to be talking a little bit about that, and I'm going to be smoking a little bit of a Newport Boost Gold. This cigarette came with a coupon, so and that, that's exactly why I'm smoking it. I've lost the coupon, though. I don't know where it is, so I cannot show it to you guys right now. But I think without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get one of these out and go ahead and get it lit up. Let's get it, y'all. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. That was a good hit. i got to be completely honest with y'all. That was very enjoyable. But... Should cigarette coupons still be legal? Oh yes, of course, that's my opinion, of course. I'm a cigarette smoker, of course I think cigarette ads, or not ads, sorry, I keep getting that mixed up. I, of course I think cigarette coupons should be legal, of course, I want I want 50 cents off, I want 50 cents off of a, uh, a pack of cigarettes kind of thing. It's a great deal kind of thing. 50 cents off a pack of cigarettes, I love it. But, a lot of places, a lot of places, I am very surprised that they're not pushing for cigarette coupons to be illegal I, and it's something I haven't really seen on any anti-smoking agendas kind of thing which is very interesting to me because it's something that you'd think that there wouldn't really be a coupon for it kind of thing because I mean like there's no advertising for cute for, for cigarettes anymore there's no advertising for it there, there's nothing else advertising has been banned I mean like you can't even really find unfiltered anymore or anything like that because people think unfiltered are more dangerous um, it, it's one of those things it's very odd to me it's very odd to me I would have to say um, that cigarette coupons are not really on the agenda of things to get banned. And I hope by making this video I'm not bringing up a topic and ruining it all, uh, for everybody, you know what I'm saying? But, and it's something I find really amusing. But, my number one reason for why cigarette coupons should not be banned, my number one reason, and really my only reason, is that literally everything has coupons. Literally everything. There is no reason for there not to be cigarette coupons or cigarette incentives, let me put it that way. Because alcohol has coupons too. Alcohol has coupons, everything has coupons, no matter what it is kind of thing. And I think that having an incentive to buy a product is not really a bad thing. I personally don't think that 50 cents off of a pack is gonna make some uh, person who doesn't smoke buy a pack of cigarettes just because it's 50 cents cheaper. Because usually on packs of uh, cigarettes that are 50 cents cheaper, they're already not the cheapest thing ever. So if you're gonna buy a, uh, a pack of cigarettes kind of thing for 50 cents cheaper it would still probably be cheaper to just buy an even cheaper cigarette to be completely honest and that's that's just my personal experience i don't know uh wherever you guys live in the world maybe it's different you know what i'm saying but in my personal opinion that's uh or in my personal opinion in my area that's how it is you know what i'm saying that's just how it is and really that's the reason why in my personal opinion cigarette ads should or not cigarette ads i keep getting it mixed up y'all i keep getting my words all jumbled up cigarette coupons should not be made illegal you know what i'm saying i don't I, I really don't think they should because everything has a coupon including alcohol and alcohol is a controlled substance just like tobacco is you know what i'm saying so uh, i don't really see any difference you know what i'm saying Man, 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 this ciggy is just hitting different, though. I am just enjoying it today, you know what I'm saying? And I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. But I really do think it's odd. I really do think it's odd that not uh, many, not many, if any, have uh, uh, anti-smoking uh, agendas, anti-smoking campaigns, have really picked up on the fact that cigarette ads, or not cigarette ads, I keep getting that mixed up, I keep getting that mixed up, that cigarette coupons are really a thing, and that maybe there's something to really push to get banned kind of thing, because sometimes, I'll admit, I'll see a pack in the front of the case kind of thing, and I'll be like, yo, I want that 50 cent off uh, cigarette one right there, I want that 50 cent, and I'll be like, alright, great deal kind of thing, I wouldn't have bought that cigarette if it wasn't because of that, but I'm already a smoker, but I could definitely see some anti-smoking campaigns making a point being like, yo, this kid came off the street, he's not a smoker kind of thing, and because this cigarette was 50 cents cheaper than any other cigarette, he bought it kind of thing. I can definitely see that being pushed by some anti-smoking campaign, in my personal opinion at least. Um, I can definitely see that being pushed. So 
uh, it, is, it is a little bit odd to me that that really hasn't been a thing, especially with the push to ban uh, cigarette advertising and um, basically anything related to cigarettes kind of thing. I'm even surprised Marlboro Rewards still exists. Maybe I'll have a video um, on that in the future, you know what I'm saying? But I'm really just surprised. Maybe I'm just too much of a pessimist kind of thing. Maybe I just believe um, anti-smoking campaigns are really thinking and, and really trying out to get us kind of thing. Maybe that's just what I'm thinking. Maybe I'm a little bit of a, uh, of a uh, pessimist myself, but um, that's just my thoughts. But what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Um, what would you guys think cigarette coupons should be legal? Do you guys think they should be illegal? If so, if either way, why or why not? That is my that is, that is my question, you know what I'm saying? That is my question. Because as I said, I think they should be perfectly legal because, well, everything has coupons kind of thing, from Clorox to Tito's, everything has coupons kind of thing. And I have seen, like, $5 off Tito's bottles before. I, I, I don't know where, but I saw them kind of thing. And I was like, man, vodka for $5 off, that's a good deal kind of thing. And I'm like, maybe they were just on sale or something. Maybe it wasn't a coupon, but it was still $5 off a bottle of alcohol. So I'm just kind of like, man, this is just crazy to me. <sighs> but man, yeah, that's pretty much my personal opinion on why uh, why, why cigarette coupons should not be made illegal. And uh, as said, make sure to let me know what your guys' opinion is in the comments down below. It is just not really the most beautiful day right now, I gotta be completely honest, it certainly is not. But it is a very, very nice day nonetheless, and uh, no complaints from me. I love it when it's just cloudy and chill, and you have the bugs out just screaming at you kind of thing. It is just so nice. But um, And I do apologize for slipping up with my words in a lot of this video, a lot in this video. I just did it again. Uh, a lot in this video kind of thing. My, my small monkey brain, uh, oh, excuse me, um, is not allowing me to uh, perform at my uh, highest rates, you know what I'm saying? Uh, just kidding. Monkey brain, I do have one, but... Uh, I think I'm just a little bit stupid, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But um, really no complaints on my behalf, really no complaints on my behalf. Self-deprecating jokes are the best, I gotta be completely honest with y'all, love them. Um, but no complaints on my behalf, it is just an absolutely beautiful day. And I hope you guys' this day is just absolutely beautiful as well, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> but man, this cigarette, is this cigarette, this ciggy is just absolutely, absolutely fantastic. Cannot complain in the least. And I complain at least. The Newport Boosts are honestly something I did not sell myself up to enjoy kind of thing. The review was pretty mediocre in my personal opinion. And to me, they're still a very mediocre cigarette. But they are honestly something with a little bit of something special kind of thing. And I haven't even popped the filter yet. So let's go ahead and do that, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there we go, there we go. I popped the filter. Hope that was some ASMR for y'all. But hey, no complaints on my behalf. No complaints on my behalf, you know what I'm saying? Cannot complain at all. Definitely just something I'm enjoying, and this menthol is about to hit different. Man, 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 man. Absolutely, absolutely fantastic. No complaints on my behalf. No complaints on my behalf. Man, man, man. No complaints. No complaints on my behalf at all. But uh, yeah, cannot really complain, you know what I'm saying? Cannot really complain. I'm just enjoying this little bit of a, uh, a little bit of not a beautiful day, but that's not really such a bad thing. It's currently about 80 degrees, very low humidity, which is very nice. I don't really like the humidity all that much. And uh, it's just a nice day kind of thing. It's very chill, there's very little wind kind of thing. Um, and it's just nice. It's perfect smoking weather, you know what I'm saying? It's perfect smoking weather, and uh, perfect smoking weather deserves a cigarette, you know what I'm saying? Man, 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 man. This is just absolutely fantastic. Cannot complain in the least, cannot complain in the least. But uh, I think I got one more hit left, so I'm gonna go ahead and take that, and then I'm gonna go into the video. Let's get it, y'all. But yeah, I think that's, uh, maybe I got one more hit left. Let's go and take that. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, if you guys enjoyed the topic I'm talking, I was talking about today, and I hope you guys did, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram and my book and my merch in the description down below. Highly recommend you guys check all those out, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. Until the next one, y'all, stay safe and peace and have a great one. I hope you guys are enjoying your day, as said. And uh, if you guys aren't, well, I hope this video made your day just a little bit better. Have a great one, y'all. Stay safe out there.